Hi everyone, I'm Armozi and welcome back to Let's Play Civilization 5 as the goals. So, let's continue where we left off. I decided to declare war on the Kells right now. I have more than enough units and I'll need a few turns to kill all these defenses anyway. So let's declare war. I won't lose any happiness. I will be at war with Jerusalem, which is slightly annoying, but whatever. I can handle that. I am just going to chill in the back and let them throw themselves at me. That's my strategy. <laughs> yeah. And once they lose the majority of their units, because they are silly, then I'll attack it in battle. I'm not in a huge rush. Also, the battleship will do tons of damage here. I can already kill this guy. Well, yes, I can. If I swap these. Alright, bye. I don't need this bazooka here, I can just move back to Truro. Fortify cargo ship. Also, I got a new rocket artillery in my capital. I might keep that one in Addis Ababa, just in case Ethiopia gets any silly ideas. I'm pretty sure they won't, but I'll keep one unit there, you know, just in case. Just to be safe. Fortify. This is supposed to be a railroad. But this stupid infantry is blocking the way. No, that's their tile. Right, I need this railroad to go like this then. Which means this tile needs a railroad. And then this one. So, not much else I can do on this turn. I can move out of the city and attack something. I should be able to liberate Antana Bananarivo on the next turn. And that will destroy like five nukes inside the city. That's going to be awesome. Unless Russia moves them first, which is definitely possible. Let's rebase these bombers now. My range is not enough. And we're done. I'm at two happiness only, but I should gain happiness from Samoa. And Polynesia lost its capital again and recovered it. I was really hoping that Russia will keep Honolulu at least for one or two turns. To give me a chance to take it, but nope. I guess that won't be happening. Alright, that destroy... Actually, yeah, the destroy will be useful here. I almost lost my battleship. Alright, maybe I should be a little bit more careful then. Move into the city. Let's see then. Well. Kill that artillery. That is a lot of units, but it won't be a big problem. Bazooka first. Attack this guy. Yeah, focus on one unit at a time. Any more attacks? Yep, one more. Shame I lost all these hit points on that battleship. It won't do as much damage now. Okay, that's that. Railroad. And back to Russia. Wow, I almost lost my mechanized infantry. That would have been bad. That was way too close. Of the bazookas to handle all that infantry. Right, back to Russia properly. City state first. Oh, the nukes moved. But I'm still going to take the city. Or liberate, not take. Is this enough damage? I think it is. If I use the bombers, should be. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is enough, but I'll have to attack it twice with the destroyers. Or I can attack it with a fighter first. That's not such a brilliant idea. Yeah, I'll have to attack it twice with two different destroyers. Alright. Is this actually enough? I'm pretty sure this is enough. I don't have bonus against cities. Liberate. And that gives me a city-state. Very nice. So, back to Russia properly. Samoa, I won't be taking it on this turn, that's for sure. I need to kill all these units. Alright, and I need to move my mechanized infantry. Back to Yakutsk. It will stay in Addis Ababa. The land ship will have to take Samoa. But not yet. 
I should go for combined arms next. Also, I should start building spaceship parts just in case I decide to get a spaceship. I might go for domination, we'll see how it goes. I only really need to take capital cities from Russia because Russia is controlling most of the capital cities. I will take Edinburgh. So if I take every single capital city from Russia, then I'll just have to take Honolulu and I'll win the game. So perhaps I'll do that. I'll decide as I play. How many more attacks do we have? One, three, only three more. I got the bazooka too, but I can't really use it very well. I should move it over like this. Great general will stay in the city. I can't kill any more units on this turn. I'll just do some damage to that mobile sum. The infantry can't attack anything because this is a hill. This is also a hill and there's no road. Attack this. Attack one more time. I could try to destroy that helicopter gunship. Nope. One hit point. Come on. I had units that survive with one hit point. Oh, new policy. This is an interesting choice. I don't really need any of these. Yeah, these are not amazing, honestly. They are pretty useless, in fact. I could go for media culture to avoid ideology pressure. I could go for a level 1 happiness tenet to get a level 2 tenet next. That's more useful. I might go for a level 1 tenet. There are still some useful level 2 tenets that I can get. Let's see. What's the most useful tenet here? Probably the extra happiness, honestly. This should give me plus 6 or plus 7. Plus 3 gold from all trade routes with other civilizations following freedom. It's not bad because I have trade routes with Polynesia. But I still prefer extra happiness. That's 11. Yeah, that's pretty good. Now this turn is done. Do I want to move that land ship? No, probably not. I should be fine. Yep, I'm fine. No longer friends with Brussels. Oh, the Celts got international games gold reward. Okay. Russia almost beat them. I don't mind. I will be taking it in Boros soon anyway. <laughs> they won't get to use that reward for very long. But that's a lot of units swarming Cardiff. Still not enough to do anything. Not really. Alright, I will actually use that bazooka. No, I won't. But we just got logistics. How convenient is that? Can I use that bazooka? Yeah, I can. There we go. Attack this. More bazookas. They will have to wait for their turn. Destroy that. This is going to be some good experience. Let's see. What can I still do? Battleship. Destroy this. Destroy this. How many more shots? Just one more. No, two more. Kill the infantry then. I think I can kill that guy. The nice thing is that I have accuracy on most of my artillery. And this is all flat terrain. So I'll be getting a bonus against almost every single unit here. And against battleships as well. Because accuracy works against naval units. I can attack battleship with my destroyer. I could try to capture that battleship with my destroyer. Yeah, that might happen. Okay, Samoa. I could capture it right now. But I still don't see any Polynesian units, so there's no huge rush. Russia might still retake Honolulu. They will keep flipping the city back and forth. I hope Russia will keep it. Let's move towards it then, just a little bit. I could move one more tile, but I don't want these units to turn and attack my landship instead of attacking Honolulu. 
I can still attack this infantry closest to me. Okay, kill this first. I have a lot of firepower here. Alright. My kind of infantry will have to stay inside the city. I should attack these units. Just in case. They might be able to retake Antana Banana Rivo. Down you go. Move back here to heal up. Yeah, let's kill this guy. The other units will retake Honolulu easily anyway. One more. Two more. Down he goes. Off the railroad. We need a few more turns. This railroad will make my life much easier because I'll be able to move my units around much faster. Repair. Fortify. Intercept. Oh, I still got the bombers. Just attack this guy then. And again. We're done. Plus one population. And plus one population in Yakutsk. 31 population in my capital. Not bad. I'm quite happy with that. Next. This is going quite well. And Polynesia took their capital again. Damn it. Now, I don't plan to declare war on you. <laughs> don't flatter yourself. I have no reason to attack you. Why would I ever want to do that? He's down to like four cities. Six cities, including some really crappy ones like this. 21 pop on a tiny island. I guess that's mostly because of the fish. That's actually a fairly decent city, in all honesty. Better than this one, but this one has uranium. Atomic bomb. Right, back to Samoa. And back to the Kells. War on two fronts is fun. We got a tank. Kill this. Yeah, I need to be careful what exactly I'm attacking. If I'm not careful enough, I might actually lose Cardiff, which would be pretty bad. Let's not get overconfident here. Let's see. That tank needs to go down. I got logistics on this guy. That's actually quite useful. And I'm about to get logistics soon-ish. Let's see. Kill that artillery. That's definitely a threat. I can just use my fighters. Yeah, sure. I'm not seeing any bombers. Nah, they can't take Cardiff. There's no way. They don't have enough firepower. Or I have too much firepower to defend it. Let's just kill this in one shot. Why not? Is that it? Can I use anything else? The mechanized infantry, which is not terribly useful. Alright. We got accuracy free. Let's see. Kill this, kill this. I could go attack Florence. That's yet another city state I could liberate. That's good. Bombardment free. And I can send my battleship to attack some other cities. I'll wait for my destroyers first to regain full health. So Honolulu, it looks like Polynesia might be keeping Honolulu, unfortunately. I don't see any more Russian melee units in the area. Which kind of sucks, I was really hoping Russia will keep it. Unless they have a tank in range or something like that. Yeah, Polynesia has a lot of crap. Oh well, hey, you never know. They have a destroyer and infantry inside. I'll keep that land ship close enough, just to have the option of attacking it. Another new rocket artillery. I don't need two rocket artillery units here. I could airlift one of them to Cardiff. Accuracy, accuracy. Let's airlift one of them to Cardiff. I can still do it in time to be useful. No special resources, unfortunately. Farm. And the railroad here. 
Actually, no, that is already a railroad here. Yep. Okay. We got cover one. Or march. I think cover is more useful. Because bombers, broken artillery, and things like that. Okay. Well, I still don't need to take someone just yet. That's a lot of bombers. Yeah, Russia built a lot of bombers. I, I love spamming these. Down you go. Let's go attack Florence with some more units. I could take Samoa with Mobile Sam. Not a bad idea. Well, first of all, kill this. And then... I'm running out of targets here. So let's take it with the Mobile Sam. On the next turn, I killed most of the units in the area. I can take the city now. Alright, next. Or not yet. Yes, continue the railroad. This is going really well. Come on, Russia. Take Honolulu one more time. Declaration of friendship with you. Okay, that's funny. I am going to accept. Because why not? I don't need to go to war with him ever again. That was slightly unexpected. I didn't think he will accept the creation of friendship with me again. But alright. To be fair, I did liberate two of his cities. So that's probably that. Right, let's try to capture that battleship. That would be nice. Like this. I got 50% chance. Nope, didn't get it. It was worth a try though. I don't like that tank too much. Definitely not. But I don't want to move here because then I won't be able to take advantage of logistics. Instead I can do something like this. And attack twice. Or once. Okay, I messed up a little bit. And that's okay. Swap these units. Attack him. I can still use my fighters. There we go. Going well. Fortify. What about the workers? Do I want to remove anything? Oh, this tile still needs a railroad. Alright, fair enough. Looks like I'm pretty much done here for now. I'll keep the workers in the area. Let's take Sama already. I waited long enough. Possibly a little bit too long. There is a mobile sum next to it. Still, I'll be taking it. Let's see. Just need to think about my moves. I do have the bombers. I need to kill melee units that would be able to retake the city. Not because I can't retake it, I can, but because I don't want to lose the unit that will take the city. That's mostly it. I'll kill this guy in the front, that's pretty obvious. I still need to attack the city itself one more time. So, like this. This guy needs to attack twice. Now I can take it. So, create puppet. I could liberate it, but I want the Forbidden Palace. Wow, 24 happiness. Holy crap. <laughs> okay, that's nice. Only one wonder in this city. Well, two wonders. But that's the only wonder that matters for me right now, the Forbidden Palace. Alright. Now. I need to kill that mobile Sam. Can I actually do that? No. No, I can't. Yeah, I actually can't do that. I messed this up a little bit. I can attack it. But I can't do enough damage. Can I do enough damage? There's no road here, but I can use the road to move towards it. Well, I can still try. Yeah, I can do it. Right, I was scared there for a moment. I don't see any other melee units. Unless Russia has a tank inside the fog of war that I can't see. That's definitely possible, but unlikely. 
Now, I might want to block the way for that infantry. I will take some damage on my rocket artillery, but that was hard to avoid. I can move here. That's still pretty dangerous for my bazooka, but I'd rather lose the bazooka than experienced rocket artillery. I got the fighter, but no, that's not useful at all. Anything else I can do? Assign delegates? War leader? I'll vote for myself. Can I sell my world leader vote to Polynesia or something? No. Okay. Well, I don't think Russia will be taking Honolulu anymore. Which kind of sucks. I'll still chill right next to the city, you know, just in case they have a tank. But I don't think it will be happening. Not that it's a big problem. I can always take the city myself anytime I want. But it would be nice to have it now. No more targets. Actually, yeah, I can attack the tank. Destroyer, it's back to full health. Let's go have a look around then. There are a few city states I could attack. I could liberate some Chinese cities. And you will airlift. To help against the Kells. And this turn is almost done. The railroad is done. At least... Was this a railroad? Or am I going crazy? No, it's not done. Now it's done. So, Russia, please take Honolulu, thanks. No? Okay, I actually lost some unit. Oh, I lost the bazooka. Whatever. Either they lost the bazooka than rocket artillery. Not the end of the world. Anything else? No longer friends with Antana Bananarivo. What? Really? I liberated you. Oh, because Russia took it. Okay, at least we have a target for our battleship now. Use the bombers against it. Or I can use the rocket artillery. Yeah, this is enough. Liberate it again then. There we go. Alright. Back to the fun part. Killing these guys. Let's not lose more bazookas. Battleship. Yeah, the Kells don't stand a chance. No, I don't want to do anything yet. I could liberate this city. Uh, I mean, not liberate, annex it. Yeah, I should annex it by now. Let's do that then. I lost unhappiness, but I have lots of happiness. That's not exactly a problem. Manual specialist control. And let's maximize our production here. To get that courthouse ASAP. Then monument. City walls. Barracks, armory and all that good stuff. Okay. Well, this is fun. I can actually propose something. What do I want to propose? World religion? World ideology. It would be nice to get world ideology. Freedom. Alright, let's go for that one. I might be able to get that. Yeah, it might actually pass. We'll find out. In 15 turns. In 16, technically. Okay, Russia still has a lot of crap to throw at me. Not that I'm very surprised about that. I'm not. The fighter needs to stay on intercept. Move back with that rocket artillery a bit. Attack this guy. I'm mostly protecting Samoa right now. So this guy needs to die, if possible. Let's see, can I kill him? I think I can. Yeah, I can. What? Oh. Fighter? I wasn't going to use the fighter, but now I kind of have to. Unless I want to leave him alive, which I don't. He's down. I don't see any other melee units. No melee units here, unfortunately. Oh well. I was hoping there will be a tank or something, but... Right, Erinboro. 
The Kells are already running out of units to throw at me. The production base is not exactly amazing right now, so... They couldn't build too many units. Yeah, they don't stand a chance. What about these workers? All the railroads are finished. I should build the railroad to Samoa. That's definitely useful. New fighter, interception 1, interception 2, and rebase to Yakutsk. This is going quite well. More railroads. Yep. And more railroads. This should be quick. I could bait Russia with the worker. One more shot. If I move. Is that the last artillery in the area without logistics? I think so. Fortify. And we got another great scientist. I might save that guy for now. One more attack. I can't actually attack anything from here. Nope. Actually, yes, I can. And battleship. Kill this guy. Are we done? Alright, we're done. Next turn. This is a lot of fun, I have to say. I might even go for the mination. I'm thinking about it. I need to see how close Russia is to building the spaceship. But once I take their higher their highest production cities, they won't really have the production for the spaceship. Yeah. How many techs do they have anyway? They actually have one more tech than me. Alright, I'm almost impressed. They are focused on research in their capital, not on units. Alright. Whatever. Anyway, I'm going to finish this part here and continue in next one. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon.